New York was glistening with stars on Monday night. The annual Met Gala drew some of the biggest names in film, television, and fashion. The gala's red carpet is known for celebs showing off their eclectic and bold styles, all for the main event, a fundraiser to raise money for the Metropolitan Museum of Arts Costume Institute. But how do you get to New York City's Metropolitan Opera House from the Navajo Nation, the Navajo Reservation? You practice a lot, and two men did. Team 12's Nyla Charles tells us about how those men represented their roots. That is wild. <laughs> Kenneth Shirley and Dominic Pablo took this video as they were approaching the Met Gala. They proudly showcased their native culture through song, fashion, and dance with indigenous enterprise. Oh, man. Monday, they brought their heritage to the Met Gala red carpet. Here cheering from the behind us and I guess the, the, the crowd across the street from the Met Gala were cheering and I'm like, I looked, I'm like, who are they cheering for? Like, who got out the ride? And they were looking an hour away. <laughs> so I'm like, oh, they're cheering for us. Just a month ago, the men were invited to walk the red carpet by a friend catering the event. She called us up, like I said, I think it's very important that we have indigenous representation. The theme, Gilded Glamour. A nod to the grandeur of the 19th century America, a time when wealth was held by very few, and the U.S. government was waging wars to crush Native Americans and drive them from their native lands. But even in that gilded age, we weren't even considered, you know, U.S. citizens in our own country. So, on our own land. On our own land. You know, on our own homeland. So, and we would have been arrested for what we were doing. Fast forward to 2022, adorned in their handmade men's fancy war dance regalias. Tiana Taylor wants to take a picture of us. Bradley Cooper's coming up to us. And we think that's a beautiful thing. Representing the state of Arizona and the Navajo Nation. It was only fitting because that the theme was America, and we had to let them know what the real America is. Nayla Charles, 12 News.